hi guys welcome to another farming video now today i'm gonna show you guys what's going on over here now i got some rain yesterday and look at the tomatoes they're just blowing oh look at that the whitehead need to come out and these grass man they're busting up like crazy yo do not believe so this this grown weed out already so you see how the um tomatoes are spreading the entire ground is almost locked you can hardly find walking space between these tomatoes guys now the cucumbers now they're at a loss i had picked some off it the other day but the rest does get burned right up so I'm just going to go in and show you guys what's going on. So I still have some cucumber on here that I can pick. But the rest, all these young ones, they're going to be at a loss because they don't have any leaves to carry them through. So I'm going to show you guys what's going on in my tomato grow. So guys, we have a lot of tomato here that has pushed up over the um, over the holiday period. So there's a lot of tomato in here. It's really bearing a lot. And this is the tree that was curdled. It still pushed out some tomatoes. So I guess that's not too bad. not too bad at all so I'm just giving you guys an update on what's going on here now to today guys I'm gonna um, fertilize the top part of um of broccoli yeah I'm gonna give it some fertilizer like how I get the rain and it it will be the first time it's been fertilized Look at the sweet pepper guys. Tell you, rain is a good something, but not too much rain is not good. But look at the sweet peppers. They're coming out. They're burning a lot also. Man, look at these tomatoes. They're so big. So there are still blossoms and there are small tomatoes. And you have bigger ones. And you have ones that's ready to pick. Then look at this sweet pepper. There's a big sweet pepper on here, guys. Look there. And sweet peppers, I think, are at um, $350 per pound. And guys, tomato are rising like crazy. I think it's at $450 now, $4,450. Last week it was at three three hundred and three fifty and four hundred and this week i'm here it's going up it's like at four hundred and four fifty so guys hopefully hopefully i'll catch that price hopefully because my tomato aren't ready as yet i think this tomato need another month so i'll probably start picking in the end of january but as i said i'm gonna keep on give you guys updates and what's going on look at that one that one's huge now guys i'm gonna show you guys something that i've never seen before in a tomato plant this one branch you see this one long branch going all the way down here so it have one two three four five tomato bunch on it i've never seen that before in a tomato plant let me give you guys a better view of the whole plant yeah i have never seen this before in a tomato plant so you have blossoms blossom and young tomato eggs and then you have all of these have eggs on it all of this one have eggs and all of this, these ones are maturing very nicely so guys i've never seen that before in a tomato plant and the rest of the tree also have tomato on it 
and guys this is just one tree let me show you this is one tree all of this is seen right here is one tomato tree with so many branches oh my god this tomato is flourishing now guys what i'm seeing here is the leaves are beginning to rot i don't know if it's because of the juju rain we've been getting but the leaves are starting to rot so whenever i see leaves like this i tend to um pick them off before they spread because this is this is fungus it's fungus that's on the leaves so you, you want to pick it off before it um it spread to the rest of the plant and use some fungicide some strong fungicide and spray the plant so as you can see guys this is fungus and that's called it's caused by the um, mildew because of the rain so yeah gonna have to spray this today i didn't plan to spray it because i didn't plan to spray it until tomorrow but because i'm seeing all these um fungus and that's what that's, that's the same thing that's going on with the um with the cucumbers so i'm gonna spray this with some fungicide today because it's kind of cold right now and as you can see right there is the hill so the coal is coming out of the hill and it's coming down on the plant so I'm gonna have to get this spray off anyway guys please don't forget to subscribe to my channel like this video leave a comment and share with all your friends thanks so much for watching see you in the next one